my advice. There's no shortcut. Uh, you must learn your music. I, I think it's nice to learn properly at least one instrument. I'm not saying you have to. A lot of great players are by ear. Fantastic. But I think it's nice if you do have a little bit of musical knowledge. You know, piano is a good basis. And um, then my advice is go out there and do the gigs. Every gig you can get your hands on. It doesn't matter if it's to a couple of drunks in the bar that don't want to hear you. It doesn't matter if it's in an old people's home. It doesn't matter where it is. Work. Do the gigs. Learn your trade. Because until you can entertain people that don't want to see you, you don't know what you're doing. You know, you got to pull them in. You got to learn it. Got to learn it. It's invaluable. I mean, I worked from the age of 14 doing just that. And I pride myself that I can entertain anybody. And I will. I'll find a way. Maybe they don't want to hear me doing what I'm doing, but I'll find a way, you know, to entertain you because that's my job. When I, when I uh, had my first passport when I was 17, we all went down. We were going to Vietnam. And uh, everybody put down, you know, occupation. I looked at everybody else's and I thought, oh, they had all put on musician. You know what I put on mine? Entertainer. So that was my attitude, even though I am a musician. When I got started to get pretty good, like 16, 17, started to get a little bit cocky. I'm getting pretty good. And my father said to me, he said, uh, yeah, you're getting okay on that bass. I said, thanks, Dad. He said, duh. You think you're pretty good, right? I said, yeah. He said, okay, come and do one of my shows. No problem. What? Dee, 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 doom, doom, doom. Are you kidding? No problem. So he took me to a gig, <laughs> left me to it. He wasn't on the gig. Uh, keyboard player, uh, guitar, clarinet, and myself. And they were doing all these popular hits from the 20s, the 30s, the 40s that I grew up with. Did I know how to play it? No, I did not. So I kind of edged my way over to the keyboard. I said, excuse me. I got to read your music. He went, he gave me a little wink like that. So I followed the music and they were very pleased with me and he let me do another gig. <laughs> but oh boy, big mouth. Oh, no problem. Ha. Huh. Rock and roll is easy compared to that. Easy. You know, you're talking serious chord changes and you got to know your chord changes to be able to do it. Fantastic. What a learning process that was.